three what is up design family and welcome back to another episode of fit design tv on today's episode we'll be showing you how you can create your own fully customized model studio or even lifestyle mock-ups completely free in under 30 seconds so how do you go from this to this completely free customized with any mannequin you want and any mock-up you want fully customized for you in under 30 seconds well the secrets underlie in the following you'll need three key things and number one is you will need some form of mock-up a high quality mock-up that you can customize whether you create it yourself whether you hire someone whether you purchase a pre-made one that's completely up to you for me of course at fit design i'm going to use my own tech pack templates that you can find on fitdesign.com and then you can just go down here tech pack template and you can pretty much download any single one you want and all of them come with super high quality pngs once we have those then we're going to go on to huggingface.com or .co forward slash spaces forward slash easel forward slash idm dash v t o n and this is going to open up this dashboard then what we're going to need is the actual mannequin that we want to drape our garment onto there's a bunch of pre-made ones here or you can go ahead and download any one that you want from a unsplash so basically a website that allows you to have royalty free model images or you can just use something i'm using this alphalete one again you should not be using the alphalete or any other company without their permission of course but this is just a test run here for demonstration purposes not for commercial purposes once you're done you source your assets and then come onto here and then you can create your customized mock-up so the first thing that you're going to want to do is you're going to want to upload the image of your mannequin the actual garment or the actual person that you want to drape your design onto so here i have this amplify this image it's a high quality reference image and also because i know that i want to drape a bra onto here the fact that her arms are exposed are just going to give the program less to have to fill into so i'll just upload this right here and then you see right there you're going to want to go use auto generated mask this is simple it's just going to create a mask over the area that it needs to inpaint or to fill in using ai and then you can either have the auto crop resizing on or off i'm just going to have it off no need and then here the second one you're going to have the upload of the product that you actually want so this is going to be your customized product here i've already downloaded from the fit design website i downloaded my customized mock-up which is this asymmetric bra front view so you'll be able to see right here the different files that you get automatically as with any tech pack template purchase you get your full 360 renders that come in all the different views in this gray color that you can easily paint in you get on body renders you get the placeholder images you get a photoshop file that has all the views that you can immediately and instantly colorize right here simply with the click of a button and you can increase and you can change the colors and you can go file export as png very easy keep it simple but for this purpose i kind of already pre-done the work for you and i have this gray mock-up you want to use the front view high quality png and then upload it onto here and then the last step of the process is essentially describing the product you want and i found you should describe what you want because you don't want the software to have to fill in the gaps for you so i've done this before where i've uploaded an image like this which is effectively sleeveless and what the software had tried to do was fill in the sleeves and create its own design so i'll just say this is an a symmetrical sports bra just so that it knows the sports bra it knows where it needs to fit it definitely knows that there's not going to be any sleeve designs and then simply at the end you go down here and you apply try on you're going to need to give it a little bit of time and it's going to access a GPU. Once that GPU becomes available, then it's going to automatically create your mockup for you. In the meantime, we'll be able to come down here and we'll be able to see what it's creating. Notice it takes around 32 seconds. So we'll just speed up through this process. Dun, 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 d
tun 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 and then you'll find the output right here which is great you'll be able to kind of see oh what is it missing is there any issues you'll be able to right click and then save image as and simply save that image and you have it right there if for any reason you don't like the output you can immediately ask it to retry but i prefer instead of adding a try on you can go back here and you can increase the denoising steps around 40 that's just going to help clean up the design a little bit and you can completely change the seed maybe like 142 so what the seed is it's a unique string or a unique set of comp computations that the software or the ai is actually doing in order to create this specific simulation or this specific image by changing up the seed you're forcing the ai to have to attract or to approach this creation from a different angle so now we can see here go back and try on and we should get a completely different result so that was with a sports bra now let's create a completely customized oversized drop shoulder t-shirt for example here we'll be able to use our specific mock-up which is our unisex men's organic lounge drop shoulder tee first thing i do is i'm going to come in here and i'm going to drop in my logo which i already have pre pre-made i'll drop it in it should be as a png position it on the front view and then automatically come here and i can use the color adjustment layer and i can colorize increase the saturation a little bit up change the hue to whatever I want and then simply hold down command and then hover over the preview image and then press down on it and then I can clip in using the cropping in order to crop just my required front view so it's as simple as that clip and then crop and then simply go file export as and then png it's better to have it as a png come here I can call whatever I want, Nike sportswear mock-up. And then voila, this is done. Come back to here. And I've already pre-made this just so that you guys have access to it. You can see I've used this athlete unisex graphic t-shirt, men's mock-up, uploaded it into there. Again, same settings, use auto-generated mask. I don't need to create my own mask. You can see what it's creating on the right. Upload my garment, give it the name. It's an oversized drop shoulder t-shirt. Come back down here, simply I get the beautiful mock-up at the end that has everything that I need and I can just save it. And if I needed to try this again, simply come down here. And then you can see here, I've, I've played around with the seed a couple of times from 40 to 60 to 146 to get the setting or to get the final result that I like. So if you stuck around this long, as a major thank you from me to you for watching these episodes, for potentially even being subscribed to the channel. You can pick up for the next 72 hours any one of our tech pack templates from our website www.fitdesign.com forward slash tech pack templates so you can see digital downloads tech pack templates and you can get 50 percent off just by using the code fdtv50 on checkout so let me know what you guys come up with what interesting designs you guys create I say this from the very bottom of my heart. Thank you so much for tuning into this episode of Fit Design TV. If you want to see other episodes like this in the future where I share unique resources, unique skills that I picked up in my journey as a fashion designer, let me know in the comments below what sort of videos you'd want to see next. Thank you guys so much. And until next time, stay awesome.